Rules for photographing a scoliotic patient started out because of my personal experience with scoliosis. I discovered that I have scoliosis at 13 and later on went for a surgery. And at the same time, the project was also spurred because of a very serendipitous encounter with an archive in the Wellcome Collection in London. And I chanced upon books about scoliosis where one of the book actually had an image of a tree being tied. That to me was a very aha moment because um, I made a work in 2015 and 2016 looking at trees being tied around Singapore and that work was titled Ways to Tie Trees. At that time, I have never associated the way the trees were tied to my own condition living with scoliosis. So, it was really a moment that made me want to make a project around scoliosis. When I was awarded this documentary award, I decided to work with other people with scoliosis and collaborate with them to learn more about different journeys and paths that people took on. Throughout the whole process, I took on a lot of little visual exercises where I played with images, whether found or original. I played with materials like branches and as well as foam bodies from the doctors in the hospital. And eventually, I think when it comes down to thinking about the exhibition, it's also thinking about how these little objects or images or videos can exist together in the same space. I hope that this exhibition can be a way to create some awareness for scoliosis and to help people with scoliosis feel less alone in their journeys. I hope that this body of work can challenge the medical gaze in a way where human bodies can be seen in a more nuanced and poetic way 